English pronunciation practice with tongue twisters from EspressoEnglish.net. Are you ready for some advanced English pronunciation practice? Try these tongue twisters. Number one, Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Did Peter Piper pick a pack of pickled peppers? If Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers, where's the pack of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? A peck is a unit of measurement equal to about eight quarts or seven point six liters. Peppers are a type of vegetable, and pickled peppers means the peppers are preserved in vinegar. Number two. A big bug bit a bold bald bear, and the bold bald bear bled blood badly. Bug is another word for insect. Bald means the bear has no hair, and bleed or bled in the past is when blood comes out of your body. Number three. She sells sea shells on the sea shore. The shells she sells are sea shells, I'm sure. For if she sells sea shells on the sea shore, then I'm sure she sells sea shore shells. On the sea shore means near the ocean or on the beach, and this is a sea shell. Number four, swan swam over the pond. Swim, swan, swim. Swan swam back again. Well swum, swan. Swim is the present tense. Swam is the past, and swum is the past participle. A pond is a small body of water, and a swan is a type of bird. Number five. This is considered one of the hardest tongue twisters in the English language. The sixth sick sheik's sixth sheep's sick. A sheik is a leader of an Arab family or village, and this animal is a sheep. Now let's try all the tongue twisters fast. Ready? Number one. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. Did Peter Piper pick a peck of pickled peppers? If Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, where's the peck of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? Number two, a big bug bit a bold bald bear, and the bold bald bear bled blood badly. Number three, she sells seashells on the seashore. The shells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. For if she sells seashells on the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Number four. Swan swam over the pond. Swim, swan, swim. Swan swam back again. Well swum, swan. Number five. The sixth sick sheep, sixth sheep sick. Thanks for watching English tips from EspressoEnglish.net. If you liked this video, please share it.